By the end of this video, you will have learned how to make custom DJ drop effects like this. DJ Simba. So before we get started, I just want to put it out there that if you like the DJ drop I made and want one like that one, I will be making a free custom DJ name drop for the first five people to subscribe, share and comment on this video. DJ name drop effects are essential for every DJ and perhaps what's more essential is a DJ name. So if you have a DJ name, we're going to show you how to convert that DJ name into a DJ drop effect like the one that we just showed you. Here's a list of the stuff we will be using in this video. The first thing is you need a smartphone. If you don't have a smartphone, you can still use an Android emulator for PC. The emulator just plays as an Android platform for you to download stuff, maybe through Google Play Store. Which brings me to my next thing that we need for this video. You need the voice changer app, which you can only get from Play Store. So I've been looking into other options, the ones that you could just download the voice changer as a software, but I haven't gotten one that is as effective as this one. But if you have found one, you can still comment in the comment box below. So the third and final thing that we use, it goes without saying, we need the virtual DJ software. So you can get this if you haven't gotten it yet. By the date of me posting this video, the latest version of virtual DJ is virtual DJ 2021. And there's a video that I made where you can check out how to download the virtual DJ 2021. Number one, you need access to the Google Play Store. But don't worry if you don't have an Android phone. You can consider using an Android emulator for your PC. As I mentioned earlier, the Android emulator just acts as an OS that can be run on your Windows computer. So you can just go and Google for one online. And if you can find one that is compatible with your machine, then you can set it up and you can use it for an Android OS to access the Google Play Store, which we are going to be using. That is the first thing that we need. So just in case, uh, I have left some links to some Android emulator softwares in the description box below, but that is just in case you don't have access to a smartphone. Otherwise, I would suggest using an Android phone for this download. I'm going to switch over to my Android screen. Okay, you will need the voice changer app. So to get this app, you need to go to Google Play Store and type the following. I'm going to leave it on the screen. Voice changer. Now you will receive a lot of apps with that name, but um, pick the one from Ponica Media. So this is the app homepage. You can see that we have a couple of options. I'm going to take you through the options very quickly. So we have the open an audio. So with this option, you can open any audio file from your storage and edit it. Then we have record an audio. With this, you can record your own effect using your phone. That is what we are going to be using in this video. So I'm going to come back to that. So um, the next one, we have my studio. This is where you can get all the files that you have made with the, with the app, with either using uh, the recorder voice or with the effects uh, catalog settings. Well, this one speaks for itself. Then we have effects catalog. These are the effects that we will use to edit our custom DJ drop. Lastly, we have text to audio. This option lets you type out the effect that you want and then you can manipulate it and change how it sounds and then you can download it. So um, you can try out this option, but for now we are going to be using the record and audio. There we go. DJ Simba. The recording isn't something you can use. So after recording your drop, you want to proceed and say edit. Here are, there are tons of effects you can use on your recording. Let me show you a couple. DJ Simba. DJ Simba. DJ Simba. DJ Simba. DJ Simba. DJ Simba. Your 
customization of the drop all depends on your liking based on maybe the type of music you mix but for me i just decided to use the monster effect uh, now that we are satisfied with the way the drop sounds it's time to map it onto our software now i'm just switching back to my computer screen and after transferring the files i can now access them from the virtual dj software dj simba you will now load the effect onto a deck it can be any deck the first deck or the second deck and you should loop it at this point this is to keep the audio segment you want and cut out the rest so if there is any noise in the audio you can just cut it out and just keep the the part that you want to use as your DJ drop. DJ 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 Now we go to record sample tab. Depending on the version of virtual DJ you are using, the location of the record sample might be someplace different than mine. I'm using virtual DJ 221, remember? So to get it, I told you that I had this video that I made, so you can go and check it out. DJ Simba. So after recording the sample, now locate it. You will notice that it is still in loop, and you want to make it into a drop. So to edit the sample, just click on settings. Now we can change it into a drop from this section. We can also do some other alterations like trimming and changing the volume. It's also important that you change the name so it's easy to identify the drop. When you are finally satisfied with the end product, you can now click on save. DJ Simba. Now just drag and drop the effect into one of the sample packs. Depending on the position you place the DJ drop effect, you should be able to play it using hotkeys F1 to F12. That is, if the DJ drop is in the first position, you can just press F1 and it will automatically activate it. If it is in the 12th position, you can just press F12 and it will automatically play it. DJ so as I said in the beginning of this video, if you like the DJ drop I made and want one like that, I will be making a free custom DJ name drop for the first five people to subscribe, share and comment on this video. We can still make custom effects for everyone who considers donating to our channel. Any amount is welcome. More details in the description box below. So thank you so much guys for watching. See you next time.